morning positive impact club so I wanted to share an idea with you today about big projects that you have on your plate right now yeah you know, I'm not talking about kind of answering all the emails or making the right amount of sales calls today do you have a larger project that's you know on the horizon kind of in the near future does it seem kind of like really hard to you know even wrap your brain around so you kind of ignore it and push it off hope it goes away uh, don't worry, that's really human nature. You know, I want to give you some encouragement and a thought process on just getting moving on the project. Yeah, you know, I've had too many projects like this to count. It seems like I'm always in the middle of at least two of them. Uh, for example, so right now, I'm opening a new clinic uh, in our physical therapy practice in the next 30 days. And also, Scott and I are working on our first information product for the Positive Impact Club. And it's called the 100 Day Challenge. We're pretty excited about it. But both of these things are, are huge projects, and doing them both at the same time is a little overwhelming. Uh, I, I have to admit that. You know, uh, my clinical director, who's going to be heading up the new office, just texted me, and you know, she let me know that she had you know knocked another item off of our list, very long list. And then Scott texted me, let me know he had gotten another item done on the 100 Day Challenge project. And yeah, you know, I told them both, like, hey, great work, it's really encouraging. And uh, I gave him one of my old cliche saving uh, sayings that you know I. I I still always find to be true. So I grew up on a farm and uh, I split firewood and it was really the only thing that heated our home. So, uh, and still is today actually. So I've cut down my fair share of trees uh, into pieces that will fit into a fireplace. So when you cut down a tree with an ax, uh, it can take a while. At some point in the process, you're gonna start to ask yourself, is this thing ever gonna fall down? Like I'm, I'm getting nowhere. But with each swing that you take, you're removing a little piece of wood from that trunk and you know, just making steady progress, but it's slow. You know, that's exactly how it works on big projects like this. You know, there, there's so many tasks to complete on a list you know, for a project that it's, it's just daunting. You know, at some point, you're, you ask yourself, man, am I ever gonna get this tree to fall over and complete this big project that's on my plate? So you know, the two projects I was talking about are, are in different stages. On um, one of them, the tree is definitely falling. You know, we just need to keep consistent swings and just you know, finish the job, take a little bit more wood out of the tree. Although it's not quite there, you know, I need to tape, keep taking consistent swings of the project and you know, I just have to be confident that at some point you know, we'll get past you know, the tipping point and the tree is gonna fall over. If you're working on a big project right now, I really want you to keep swinging the ax. Keep thinking about just taking out small pieces of that trunk over and over and over again, and eventually it is going to fall. Just keep swinging the ax. You guys know someone who uh, wants to learn about chopping down trees or completing big projects? Pass this video along to them. Thanks again, guys. I really look forward to seeing you again on the Positive Impact Club.